What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ. Today we're going to focus in on the uh, three-year deal that Brad Stewart signed with the uh, San Jose Sharks, worth an average of $3.6 million per year. Uh, he's coming off a four-year deal that paid him $3.75 million. Uh, with the Wings, he's 32 years old, and is going back to San Jose where he started his career. Obviously, uh, part of the Joe Thornton trade was a Bruin for uh, about a year and a half, and then uh, got shipped out to uh, Calgary, then ended up in L.A., and then Detroit. And is uh has been a wing, you know, since the LA days. And uh, you know, he, he's defensively was a liability with the Bruins, but that has been the exact opposite with the uh Red Wings. He was a sh minus twenty two in forty eight games with the Bruins in two thousand six, two thousand seven. But uh with like I said, with Detroit that has not been an issue. He's been a plus player. Uh three of the five years he's been in Detroit, so that's pretty solid. It's a step in the right direction for him. Uh you know, become more of a stay-at-home guy with the rings. Uh, I was a third overall pick, but it shocks me. I had uh, Vinny Cavalier and uh, David Legmont back in, in 1998, excuse me. And uh, yeah, it's an all-around pretty solid defenseman. Uh, I know there was some family issues involved in custody of his daughter, or stepdaughter, so I think that was part of why he went back to San Jose. Um, some, she wasn't allowed to leave California or something along those lines. So, you know, you got to do what you got to do with your family, and uh, Brad Stewart did that. Um, and, you know, I think he's going to help San Jose. Will he help? Is he the X-Factor to get him over the hump? I don't know. I, I don't think so. I think at this point in his career, he's going to you know be a three or four guy. You know, play a little bit in the second power play, help you out in a few different ways. But, uh, you know, I, I don't think he's exactly the player he was, you know, a couple years ago when they won the cup. You know, but that's not a rock on him that that happens. He's going to be 33 in November. Uh, yeah, I think it would be funny they should go out and sign Marco Sturm now and then bring Wayne Primo out of retirement. Uh, San Jose, I think, at the entire Joe Thornton trade in one place. Kind of funny, but uh, you know it's, it's a pretty good thing. I'm real happy for Brad Stewart. Uh, you know, he did what he had to do, and I think he's gonna help San Jose uh, in his own little way. And you know, it's got he won a cup in Detroit with 2000, in 2008, so he's you know been there before. Well, I was in the finals in 09, so you know he's got the experience there. It, like I said, is he the X factor? I don't know, but I think he definitely helped the team, and uh, you know, do his part to help the team win. And obviously, I think you know now that. Two California teams have won the Stanley Cup in the last five years, and neither one of them play in the Bay Area. I think the pressure's on San Jose to bring in these guys that have won before to try to get in part that wisdom and try to make a run. Um, you know, the, the core nucleus of this group's getting older, and uh, that window's closing fast. And with a guy like Brad Stewart coming in, maybe helps you, like I said. We'll see what happens. I'm excited. Uh, I'll talk on this episode of the Power Play with CJ on the three year on the three year deal. Brad Stewart signed with the San Jose Sharks. Stay tuned for episodes throughout the off season and beyond. Later, guys.